Hello Virgo and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of August 15th. Like I said, they do start, you know, now just week to week. I just put a timestamp on there so you know which one it is. Um, I posted the tarot card readings yesterday, so if you didn't check those out, um, do so. And um, I'll be posting next week. I, I, ch I switched it around the tarot cards on Wednesday the gem and runestones on um, Thursday. And if you didn't check those out, go check those out. And uh, coffee cup readings on Fridays. Anyway, uh, let's get on with your reading here. First thing what I do see, the overall thing is there's still a lot of um, moodiness, um, some indecisions and um, mind just wandering off in some areas. That's not everyone, but this is the the feel of the the uh, reading, what I'm seeing here. There are tears too, some sadness or just reminiscing depends on, you know, who you are and your situation. Um, the home area is just telling me there's just a lot of commotion and this could be internal commotion. Um, it does not mean um, there's physical people around or that, but that that's a possibility too. Or you're just like in uh, always rushing work, home, um, things like that. Some of you may be wanting to leave the home um, and you have this urgency at times and it frustrates you. That's another thing that I'm seeing here too. Um, so go along here. There is um, significant um, endings of chapters or phases coming up. Um, I don't know if I want to say exactly life altering. It could be for some of you. Um, but there is a sense, there is some um, changes and endings coming up. I don't know how fast they are, but they're showing up because you have, um, yeah, it's right over here, um, a definite sword in that. So that's telling me endings coming up. Some of you may be feeling like you're um, sacrificing a lot or um, feeling like you're a victim to something. My advice is really... Um, Always look at yourself as a survivor, whatever the situation is. Um, that's just my advice there. Then as I go along here, there is some kind of message coming in. It possibly, um, there are people out there telling you, you know, that they're there for you and they love you. That's a little heart there and a little birdie. So that's beautiful. Um, as I go along here, which is quite interesting is this is definitely on your personal side and um, in your um, someone very significant to you, but either it's, it's a man, I think it is, or, and they, it could be a female too, but there is someone behind um, this person's either coming into your life or is already in your life. Or are you thinking about it? It depends on who you are, but this person seems to be, um, a water sign, either Pisces, and then there's a crab here. It could be Cancer, or it has those qualities. Again, um, when I'm looking at it um, in other ways, it could be um, a crab bringing in um, slow but steady and uh, tenacious energy to you too. So anything that you start up at this moment, um, you will find and maneuver ways and surely come to its end. With the Pisces sign could also tell me that you could come up with a very creative idea or a creative solution out of some of your worries or problems. So that's coming in very prominent there. Um, at the same time here, when we're looking, yes, there is definitely <clears throat> an end of phase and something, uh, some things in your life, but also there is some resistance to it. There is um, a sense of resistance. Some of you may be, it, it could be subconsciously or, you know, I don't know why, but there is a sense of resistance. You know, the, the cup is a little bit, um, you know, yellow and a little bit, um, how do I say it? It's just so scattered in a way that it's, some of this is um, internal or some ongoing issues. It seems that some of you are just not happy, not happy. You know why I don't, um, you know, those are personal readings. And there is a sense of here of feeling, um, the feeling that you're sacrificing a lot or yeah, uh, feeling like a victim in some areas. But like I said, look at it as, as a survivor in whatever instance or anything there is in your life. 
Um, yeah, there are some things that are changing. So I don't know what they are, but they, they are significant changes. It's almost like an end of a phase beginning a new phase and it's, it's showing up here. Definitely. There could be two significant things that are changing in your life. Um, for some, it could be, um, life altering for some, you know, it's not. And then there are these ideas that maybe are actually making these changes. Um, some of you are thinking about, um, or you come up with good ways to and creative solutions. So really that is hard to say anything else this week. Um, sometimes, like I said, they say a lot, sometimes they don't. And some stuff are really for personal readings because they just, you know, they get in deep. Um, that's about what I can say right now. Yep. That's about all I can say right now. Nothing. Everything is in almost kind of scattered here. Anyway, and on your plate, um, I'm going to look at this. It's almost really not signifying anything. The only thing I'm looking at here is that you, um, maybe a worry or a relief to something is just comes out because it's really not saying nothing there. So sorry, Virgos. There's nothing much I could say there for this week. So let's see what comes up next week. But anyway, um, um, I hope you have a wonderful week and please like share and subscribe and enjoy yourselves and see you next week for your coffee cup readings. Bye Virgos.